Hello, this review is for the R Captain inverter welder right here. It's a stick welder. Um, it's 120 volt, so it has your normal power cable, which you can see right here. Just a three prong cable. The whole machine is really cool. It's, it's a really small portable machine. I believe the entire setup by itself is uh, just over four pounds. So it's very mobile, um, very small. And it, it has a swivel out of the way power or um, carry handle, which is really nice. So if you go on their website, uh, they have some really good how-to videos and some warranty information. Uh, they seem to really be proud of their product and be very good with it. Um, you have a very uh, pretty elaborate um, instruction manual here of how to set it up and how to properly weld with it. And then another cool thing that comes with it, it comes with some pretty fancy stickers here. So, you know, that's always cool for your welding helmet or whatever you want to put it on. So, like I said, you have the welder. Um, the on button is on the back, a little on off switch. And then on the front, you have your plugs right here for your electrode and for your grounding rod. Up here, there's a little swivel with an LED screen, and that'll show you, um, that'll adjust the amperage. Um, it'll go anywhere up to 130 amps, which is pretty cool. And then on the side, on both sides, it shows you the electrodes to select. So if you're using 40 to 90 amps, you should use a 225 rod, 50 to 100 amps, 330 second rod, and 70 to 130 amps, a 1 8 rod. So it's pretty good that it you know tells you there so you really can't screw it up. Another thing it comes with right here is just a um, carrying handle or strap. So it sets up really quick and it's actually Velcro, which is nice. So quick on and off, which should fit right through here. There we go. So it just clicks on like that. That way when you're walking out to go weld, you don't have to try and hold the machine as well. You can throw the machine over your shoulder and you know carry your welding rods, your helmet or whatnot. So like I said, you have that. Um, it comes with a little, it's almost like a chipping hammer and a scraper, which is kind of cool. I don't know if you can see them. So it's a little uh, wire brush scraper. And now another cool feature is you got your ground rod and your electrode or your striker, or stinger, I'm sorry. But um, they both have 10 foot cords, which is really nice. So you can keep the machine out of the way while you're welding, which is awesome. So right here, it shows you which one to plug it into. So this is gonna go on the left. And then this one, which is the stinger handle, will go on the right. Um, and it says it right in the instruction manual. It's just a twist lock. It's pretty secure in there. Um, so like I said, that's your grounding rod that'll clamp on your piece of metal. This is your stinger and it's got different groove attachments inside. It's kind of tough to see, but there's different grooves. You can see them right there. And that's for um, holding your welding rod at different angles. So like I said, 10 foot cords um, for the price point, you're not going to beat it. It's a really nice product. Um, you can go outside and do some welds, but hope you enjoyed it. Have a good day.